Okay, I am back. I just need to have set up my um, description and all that stuff. And then Cora's going to put the turtles outside because there's lots of scratching. And <laughs> that's what we're going to do. Anyways, I hope you guys come back and join me today. So now what we're going to do is the hair on my doll. I'm going to do the hair back here, the wool hair. And um, my first dream where I painted the doll um, took almost an hour. So the hair is going to take a while. So I decided to jump on another stream. Reason being, I just don't want to scare people off on long streams. Sometimes I see like a few hour stream and I'm like, Ugh, do I want to watch that and get involved or even put it on because I don't have that much time. So that's why I decided to do it. So then people don't look too scared. <laughs> the stream being huh, the stream being so big, so long. But I have my my do that I'm gonna try to do. I hope I'm in. I am on, just nobody is commenting yet. So if you're here, just say hello and you're back. So just to let me know that you are back, popped in back from the other stream. I'm gonna move my other wool out of the way. Gotta look for my popsicle stick, not my popsicle stick, my chopstick. I have some toothpicks and I can use some dowels maybe. Okay. I'll just use a dowel this time. You got to figure out this bun thing happening. Huh, I'm in. So if you're, I see that somebody's here. So give me a comment, say that hello. Hopefully everything went in on back. Okay, so here's the doll I just finished painting. Laying her, I did put varnish on her. She's already not tacky. And that's her. We're gonna be putting hair on this one. Gonna be doing that. Gotta figure out this hair thing. Hi, Super Beth. So I just I was just on in my last stream, but I didn't want to keep it too long. So I thought I'd jump on a new one so then they're not overwhelming for people to watch too long. So I'm back gonna be working on my hair for my doll. So I'm gonna figure this out here. I think I'm going to make a bit of a donut on her head. And then I'm going to somehow, what am I going to do? Make a donut on her head somehow, then put the hair around it, I think. Crazy glue container, that's what I'm going to use. Hopefully, everyone's going to get back that we're on my stream. I know it's crazy to jump off and jump back on, but Cora, no. Okay, so hopefully, hopefully this is kind of a good plan. So I want to do a bun. Well, that's too small. I had that the chance of the way I was doing it before. <laughs> ah, you just learn as you go. My first bun. I just, uh, I want to get a bit of thickness here, I think. Yeah. So I'm using this, this is gonna be take forever, but I'm using this Gorilla Glue, but it does dry really, really nice. So I'm hoping it does the same as like for this guy here. Hi, Denise. What does it say? What did you say? I find the clay online. I would like to make. 
Oh, the gnomes, yes. They'd be cute. Okay, the dog's just pushing me here. Ugh. So anyways, this is the hair I did. And now you can't see the gluing and I love it. It did take a while to set though. So that was the, the only setback. Put a lot of glue, sorry, a little ring. My idea, if this works, is I put a donut under the hair. And uh, I do have a chopstick somewhere if I didn't lose it. Not a chopstick, a skewer, I did lose it. The gnomes would be really fun. I'm gonna carefully put it down here. So I'm thinking, because because that styles that, that I was showing you in the earlier there, Denise, it's got such height to it. I thought, I thought this would be a good idea. Let's see if that was correct. Add some height to the back. It's already almost looking kind of, oops, it's a bad angle, kind of looking cool. Just having a little bun there or a head thing. But I think I got an idea. Now I need to cut some hair and I let that sit for a second here. This could take, I, I mean, I get sticky. This is crazy. Not really sticky. It's more like an oily feeling with this one. But I just, patience is this basically the thing you have to have with this if you're going to do it with this glue, this particular. But like I said, I do like that it doesn't have any glue chunks in it. You, you know, it's really nice that way. And I read the instructions. It just takes a long time to glue. <laughs> it's just the way it is. Got the old magnifying glass so I can read the instructions on there because they're teeny weeny. <laughs> oh, and now they're smudged. They're teeny weeny instructions. Oh, I can see them better here. I should have done that. <laughs> but. I'm like, actually, they are actually smaller when you look at this side. Where is it? Look how small they make that. I don't even know if people with actual good vision can see that. It's crazy. Okay. I'm going to go. I'm going to go with the, that length. I'm gonna keep cutting this. This is just why I wanted to start a new thing because this is gonna take a bit. You gotta cut some hair. And it was already 50, almost an hour, 57 minutes or something. I thought I was gonna be able to paint two dolls. No wonder why it took me all day for this guy. Like all day. <laughs> no wonder. And then his leather jacket, oh my gosh, like a, all morning the next day to sew it. And I was so happy when it was done. This is going to be really neat hair, though. We could even put some chalk pastel in here, in her hair. If we want to do like little old lay blue hair or something. That would be cute. Or we could just leave it this nice natural color, too. The options are endless. This is a fun process you guys are watching. Here, let's put something cute on the side. <laughs> cute. Come and sit. I still got to name this guy. Can you help me out here? I don't know what I'm going to name him. I'm thinking about clay, but I think that's kind of too <laughs> not original. Gonna make me some granny bun. I think we're gonna do what Denise said, make her into a kind of a bag lady. That means I might have to make accessories like a cart. Oh my gosh, that'd be so fun. Oh, you're getting my imagination going, Denise. Oh. 
<laughs> oh, I could see it. I could see it now. Her pushing a cart with a bunch of little can cans and bottles. <laughs> oh boy, that's going to be fun. He has started something. The bag lady. Oh, that's so awesome. Okay, this might be enough hair. I'm going to do more. Going to keep going a little bit more. This is interesting wool. I can't recall if I bought this or if it was given to me, but I, I was carting it along for so long. It's really good for filler too. So we've been using it as filler as well because there's some mixed colors like a purple and white. It's super old, but this is super nice for hair. So Beth, if you're still here, tell me how your, I don't know if you're still here. Tell me how your day is going, how's your weekend? I've been seeing that you're trying to get the uh, if the the art barn going again. Have you done that yet? Let me know what's up. Let me know which up. Okay, that's a lot of hair. A lot of hair. Okay, let's see here. So this is still really wet and I could just no no problem pull it off. So I don't want to do that. I'm gonna start with the front. I'm gonna bend her legs forward because I don't need that in my way when I'm trying to look at her hair. So just to do that and get the hair all in here. I'm hoping that this will do the same thing with this particular wool. I'm going to start with just the front. I can imagine it would work the same way. It's just getting, hmm, I might, I might need this lady to hug a bottle of glue. I'm really liking Gorilla Glue, as you can see. I have uh, some carpenters, Gorilla Glue. Okay, lady, hug the glue. We're going to use some clips to clip her up. Put your arms up. Hold on. Hold on, dear lady. Okay, clip the legs. Clip her legs. You know what I mean? Not holding on. Hold on, maybe. Maybe this is not big enough. Come here. Loud little guinea pigs today. Oh, I know what I'm going to use. <sighs> Basket day. Okay, so she's like this, holding on to my glue with her legs. I could probably actually just X me on the glue, maybe, if I put the masking tape on there. Yeah, I could just mask and tape her to the, if I don't put too much pressure on her, we'll see. Yeah, this glue doesn't dry fast, so I'm not too worried about. <laughs> hey, nope. No, absolutely not loud. If you guys, oops, the glue is falling. <laughs> the glue is falling. It's dripping down behind her ears. Ew. Oh, Ew. Okay. We're going to get the skewer out. Now I have to move. The problem is I wasn't smart enough to glue it to my smaller mat, which I actually probably should do. Didn't think that went through. T 
tape to this side will have less dust, maybe. Didn't think that went through. If I tape it down with my other one here, I can move her around to work on her. Her legs could get bent back. There we go. Hair. Grab a toothpick. So what I'm gonna do is start attaching her hair like little plugs here, I think. But stand up. This is gonna take patience. I don't wanna put too much of the hair in there right now. That's why I tried to only put the glue here for now. See how that works. It is a crazy video for you guys. Maybe. Maybe. This is basically what I did with the other one, except for I just started further back and then went more forward. and pushing in the glue. I'm sure other glues might work better, but I did like, like I said, the result on how it didn't look like there's actually any glue that the hair was just sitting on there. Just patience, 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 patience. <laughs> the fun part of the stream so this is the video people might want to make skip <laughs> the stream the stream video. So guys, comment some stuff. I don't know. Tell me what's what. I don't know. Tell me something. Because this make it interesting for everyone else. Because this is the boring part. The boring part. This might be too heavy, I don't know. It's kind of smoothing out. Wibble, 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 kind of like a... What's this? They're not making... Oh. I say we're... We are not getting old. They're making the print smaller. That's that's what I said. It's not. It's not. It's no one can see that. I don't know why. Like what is on there that they don't want us to see? But holy moly! I'm not sure if there's a lag or what, but hopefully not. Hopefully not. I think I'm gonna trim this stick down. Whew. Doesn't need to be that long. Just to kind of help out here. Oops, fibers. Oh, Cora, what time is it? Uh, oh shoot, go wake up daddy. <laughs> He didn't want to sleep past 2.30. <laughs> Tell him I'm still streaming, though. <laughs> Poor daddy. <laughs> he wants to sleep tonight. There we go. Hopefully this works. And if it doesn't, this is all Denise's idea. <laughs> her bun. Her bun. <laughs> Just joking. Just joking. This is looking like, um, what, 18 something right now, the hairdo. Oh, if I could just get it angled up for you guys, this is quite perfect. It is actually looking like that. Look, what can I put underneath here to angle it up? My wire. Not enough. More wire. Okay, can you see? Isn't that looking quite 
Antoinette, is that what the one I'm looking for? <laughs> that era of hairdo. Oops. <laughs> that's quite what it's coming to, that's what's looking like to me. <laughs> Time consuming, but it's worth it. It's going to be worth it. Yeah, I don't, I'd rather have it take more time than to have it. Oh, Corey, you should go get your purse and stuff. Sorry, I get my mind's going everywhere. I'm like, oh, wake up, Dad. Oh, you should go pick up your stuff. You forgot. Um, Oh, I can't remember now what I was thinking. Got sidetracked. My brain's going. It's a mum thing, right? I'm a woman thing. Our brains are going. We're always multitasking inside our heads. No one can deny that. No matter who you are as a woman, you're always multitasking inside your brain. <laughs> this is almost looking like, you know what's looking like? Oh, one of those dolls. Oh my gosh, troll doll. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, it's looking like a troll doll. <laughs> That's quite hilarious. Oh boy. It's actually, that's how it looks like right now. Troll doll isk. <laughs> she is already cool. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. I think I'm going to do a lot of these dolls. I really like them. I'm kind of, I still like doing paper crafts, but I all love cardboard crafts. I'm just the paper journal, paper, paper, paper stuff. It's just, oh, airplane. It's just kind of want to just do some other things too, you know? Oh. So my technique here is I put the wool down that kind of just roll off. It seemed to really work with the other hair too. So make sure it stays down. And if it pops up even a little bit, I'm just kind of making sure I'm reforcing it. So gonna do three strands and they're kind of like that. It's three strands. How interesting. You guys, you guys are awesome for watching this <laughs> gluing, letting glue, watching glue dry. I gotta put a few strands down because if I go to the style that we were talking about. We're gonna do a few strands down. You're looking cool. Thank you, Nikki. Um, oh, ha. I missed your hi. <laughs> missed your hello. This is just the front, so that's going to Looking like a troll doll. I might have cut a lot of hair for that, but okay. Plan, I have glue dripping off her ears. She's very gluey. She's very gluey. Do I have some on this side? Yep. Okay, my phone made noise. Just checking guys, just checking my noise. My, my phone made noise. Okay. It's just one of my friends and my mother. It's only them. <laughs> okay. Okay, so. Yeah, this is the side view. Crazy. Ooh. 
we have the the fake bunny thing I made in the back or on the nape or the crown I guess to make the thickness of the hair so that looks good oops I'm playing with it and loosening it up But that is it. That's what took me so long with the hair the last time. But I, like I said, the, it is worth it. It's just if you don't like finicking with it, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know. <laughs> You'll have to try some other glue. Because it said to tack this glue down and let it dry. Like basically clamp it. And it's like, yeah, no clamping here. No clamping here. Okay, I have, a, I'm gonna rip a couple hairs apart like this. And I'm going to add them to here. This is just the front, so I wanna, whoa, she looks like a bubble head the way I'm working with it now. Tear it. get a little more hair thing happening there. Oh, hi, Bonsai J. Hello. Hello. Thank you, Bonsai J. Gotta pay attention. I really wish these chats would pop up in the thing on the I like them popping up on the screen. I don't know. Maybe people don't like that. I do. I think I might go with a little, hmm, do we want? Let's check the, what was our thing? Oh no, I can't get glue on my thumb. I won't be able to open my phone. <laughs> Jeez. Didn't I do that last time, Nikki? Got glue on my thumb, couldn't open my phone. Okay. I um, wanted to check on my reference picture, but now it went off with my reference picture. Oh, I might do a little more bang in the front. Of course, you got curl. I could probably heat up uh, a tooth, you know, put a toothpick and a little, little heat tool on it and make some curl. So I think I'll add a little bit more hair in the front because I could always trim that down. That one's too long. Okay. How am I gonna do this? Okay, right here, I'm gonna add this one right here in the middle-ish, a little split maybe. Ah, so styling. Okay. We could probably trim those or curl those up. <laughs> Yeah, you know, I soaked my fingers in nice warm water and washed and washed and washed for a good 10 minutes for our stream. You guys, I'll have to have a link below for Nikki's and my stream for our group, International Crafters. We're making these wonderful terrain builds and we're doing a, a fairy, fairy garden. I'll show you quickly. Hey. Show you quickly. It's right here. I didn't put it away yet. And Nikki has hers on a nice paint palette and building hers up. But we're building this. So if you guys want to see us build this, we've been building this every week. So I'll get a link below. Or Nikki, I don't know if you can add a link. If you add, I don't know if you're allowed, but you could try. Um, but you guys could check this out. We usually stream on Sunday around noonish, but um, we streamed early this week, added the fishing pole and the, the book it, so fun. Well, it was a little struggle this week. <laughs> the uh, fishing pole was a hard one. <laughs> the guinea pigs are doing good and the turtles are doing good. We rescued one more. I don't know if you knew that. Um, so we have three now. Oops, how do you do that? 
um, and uh, they're outside sunbathing because they're making so much noise that I thought, well, we'll put them sunbathing for now. I don't want to put them outside until it's not no more frost at night. Thank you. So if you, we have, um, thank you. It's not on my channel, um, but we have not international crafters. That's both of our channels, Nikki's and myself. We um, started it. So we also have it on a Facebook group. Anyways, so I will have the information below later if you want to come back. Once they let me, you know, I do have to put the information when I'm done, but then it takes a while for them to upload these. Okay. I added some front hair. I might do one more little swoop right here. And then what I'm going to do, see, I'm just crazy here. I'm like, just going to add a little more glue. This glue is very forgiving in that sense of it doesn't dry fast. Now what I'm going to do is uh, I might add a band. We'll see how that looks. No, I never liked that. I think I'm just going to add more hair. I, oops, I thought you were daddy. <laughs> I was going to say, I started another stream. <laughs> Thank you very much. Whoops, I don't know if I put that in. Oh, you can only do it as an admin. Oh, I'll have to put you on. I don't know if I can put you on. I could keep you on permanently because that's. Thank you. I could do that. But usually, I'm not on all that often. So, but add a little bit more glue, and I'm stealing the hair away. To add a little bit more glue and do one more layer over top of what I just put on. Kind of blend that seam in my head because it's like looking pretty perfect, but in my head, I just want it to be blend that seam. I also have the back to do, so and the sides. It's a little bit different than the other guy. The other guy was quite. A fast do. Of course, if you know me, I have to outdo my last project. <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, let's do something harder. That was easy. That leather jacket was something else, though. I'll definitely take Nikki's advice on pre-punching the holes next time. We used a lot of hair. What do you think? He likes it. Okay, I started just this stream on hair. Let's see. Oops, I'm gonna bend that up a bit. Ooh, you look at that. Almost like a little, I don't know, pin curl. That was cute. Wonder if I should do that. Ah, pin curls would be cute. I might have to add them after. 33 minutes to do this part. <laughs> Yay. Crazy me. Can I have um, some cute tips, please? Chloe? Thanks. I'm cleaning ears with Q-tips. <laughs> yes, I'm going to punch the holes first. That was a definite good idea. Of course, I wish I would have talked to you about that before I started, but hey, we all learn. <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah, you should have done this. Oh. Darn, where was my brain? Okay. I'm gonna get I just gonna use a q-tip to get some of the excess glue off the ear flap. Thank you. And I get one. <laughs> oh, you'll get two. Okay, thanks. I was like, oh boy. There we go. This ear's not so bad. <laughs> Did I put that up? Uh, yes. This bag lady. I'm going to say this is now a bag lady. Uh, 
Okay. She's not going to have a leather jacket, that's for sure. Nope, nope, nope. I think I'd add, I'm done adding her hair in the front here. Let's see here. Oh, boy, oh, boy. I'm not sure if I can flip around this, this, uh, hair. I'm not sure if I can flip this around. <laughs> it's looking like hair right now, just all hair for you guys. Just want to make sure that I'm sit down for a second. I've been standing up this whole time. Not that it's like a big hard task, but I might get a better view if I flip around for a second here. I think I want to add more hair to the front. I know it's like a lot of hair, but holy... Okay. <sighs> yep, I definitely think I'm gonna need to add her hair to the front. I have glue on her chin. Holy moly. I wonder if this glue would dry. I would have to test it if it would dry like a drop. It would be really good for like uh <laughs> look like tears or something. Wow, it's getting everywhere. Okay, I might have to re not put so much glue on, rethink on the amount I put on when they first doused it. Did a little cleanup job here. A little bobble head lady. Okay. Taking the hair away. I'm going to add more hair to her front. I just want to do a little bit of glue cleanup. Right now, you guys are not seeing anything. This is so sad. I'm sorry, guys. Just trying to make sure I get all the glue. I actually got glue in her ear, out of her ear. This is quite interesting. She's looking pretty good. I just need a little more hair in the front. She's looking very bag lady-esque seriously now. I'm not sure when I'm going to be able to work on the back <laughs> because I kind of did a hairdo that's a little difficult to flip and do work onto the back. I chose something a little bit challenging for that kind of a one stream hairdo. So actually, I'm going to rethink this. I'm going to put her hair here. No, I don't want to have any flips that way. Any new thank you, Nikki. <laughs> oh, what a video. What a video. She's looking very granny-esque. Don't know if I'm gonna wreck her. I'm just trying to get her more angled so you guys can see, but we don't want any buddy falling. Any grannies having an accident. I'm gonna put a little tape here so it doesn't slide backwards. I could also bend her armature a bit so you guys can see her. As long as I'm not untaping her. I don't, yeah, I don't need to like really make her go anywhere up. Guard the thumb. Guard the thumb. Okay. So I got this nice little head wrinkle here. So I'm ending my hairline right there. So interesting. It's gluing and gluing and gluing. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna get my toothpick in there, roll, or my skewer this time, roll. 
now the glue is starting to get more congealed. Is that the word I'm looking for? So I could actually get it pressed in. And it's just a patience of things. It's a pain in the butt. But it's way better than having chunky glue spots. So where's my toothbrush? So I'm happy with it. I'm going to not complain about how long it takes. I might have to add more hair there. Oh, this lady's got a lot of hair. She's looking very cute though. Okay. I'm going to do number one on Z heating. See if I can congeal that a little bit faster. That glue. Maybe I move it up a second. Okay, move it two weeks. Then move it one. I didn't. I don't think I tried this before. But this is really barely warm. Yeah, it is like you're wrapping. That's why I said that I'm like, ah, Nikki will get this joke. <laughs> Nikki will get it. You know what's really funny, Nikki? I still haven't received that punch yet. So unsatisfied with that. I sent the, I sent, I bought, bought tons of stuff on Amazon and I still haven't received that punch. I don't know why that just kept popped in my head. Popped into my head. Where's another toothpick? Yep. And just so I'm not pulling it off, I'm just kind of rolling it. Can you hear my squeaky trebles in the background? Talking. I might add more hair here, but you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to wait till later to worry about that if I decide to. Because it looks like I could. Oh, sitting down now. Wow, 42 minutes. I'm glad I restarted the stream. I tried to use um, masking tape to um, tape the hair down last time. Didn't work, that was a fail. Um, just to get different things I tried to get to hold. But the best thing I found was just kept keep playing with it and rolling the um, toothpick and getting that to finally settle in. Whoa, things are sticking to me. So there it is, looking good. It's gonna be one nice bun. Oh boy, give me one big bun. Okay, let's see, can I move this yet? Probably not. Where can I go with this? Nowhere. Hair clip? Hmm. Oh, braid around the hairline would look good too, yeah. Yeah. Uh, braid around the hairline. She wants me to do a little itty bitty braid. Is that revenge on the fishing rod, Nikki? <laughs> Thank you, Bonsai. Chat soon. See you later. Bonsai J. Okay. I think Nikki's trying to get me back. It was my idea for the fishing rod. <laughs> Okay, moving her forward, seeing what can I, oh, that's not hair. I was like thinking, oh no, stuff's coming out. Okay, moving her forward. Trying to think, it's going to take a second here. You guys are going to see nothing but hair. 
Of course, I don't know if I can make all of this into a blend. That's a lot of hair. I'm going to need, wow, we're going to need to fix this up. Wow, I think I got a lot of hair. I think I could cut half of this off. <laughs> yep, yep, oh wow. <laughs> Oh, Nikki. So I think I'm going to cut half of this hair. Now that I'm looking at it, it's too thick to make a bun, but I really needed lots of hair for this part. So let's see here. I'm going to move this forward. I got some hair. We're going to do play hairdresser. I'm going to play hairdresser. Don't want to unglue anything. Okay. We got to, we got to divide. The sections. Okay, we're going to snip all this stuff off. Hey, and I got more hair to use now to cut more. Yay. Okay. Okay, so I'm just going to push this in here, I think. What is this woman doing? This has got to be the hardest video to watch. So I cut like half of the hair and I think I can stuff it in there. I'm going to see. Uh, what am I going to stuff it with, guys? What am I going to stuff it with? Hey, Kendra, do you want to hold some hair up? Okay, hold hair up. Don't pull. Don't pull. It's glued. Just warning. A panic warning, you know, like mm -hmm. yeah. sticking in the hole. Because there's like a little donut on the, the crown here I made. Sticking in the donut hole. I'm going to put glue in there. Okay, so that should be enough hair to make it look decent. There. Now I gotta put more hair on the bottom. Let's see what we can do. Let's see how far we can bend this baby without her hair coming out. And some of it might kind of come up a bit and then I might have to go back and push. Because I found that that sometimes when I had to look at my guy as he was drying and see if, if anything was coming off. But he was still tacky for like so long. I was able to. What bread is it? Huh? Uh, I don't know. Jackson will be home today. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Let's bend this baby. She is doing yoga. Now I get to twist her this way. I'll keep an eye on the front, and you guys can keep an eye on the back. <laughs> okay. I don't want to keep, I don't want to fluff it too much, but we're going to use another toothpick. Stick her here, just stick it in a bit. Keep it here. Just keep it from flopping up. Okay. Oh, goodness gracious, do I ever get glue everywhere? I don't need to glue the back of her ears. It just kind of um, gravitized. Gravity. So I have more hair to work with. <laughs> and I'm still not done. The video is almost an hour. The uh, stream. So I said, okay, I'm doing this part here. Let's not go crazy with the glue. Well, I think I just did. Let's scrape it up. Go away here. Come on. Don't know if my face is in there. I'm not concentrating on what's going on. I keep pushing my glasses up. I'm going to have like gorilla glue on my glasses. Okay. 
really don't know. So what I'm going to do is the same thing. Start at the base, do a few at a time. It's a lot of hair. My hands are getting a little bit tacky. Okay, I don't have to be so careful with this one. Though. Probably, I probably am going too crazy with it. I probably can get away with bigger chunks, so I'll just do that. I could always cover it up in the back, like, you know, further down. In the front, you can really see it, but in the back, I might be able to just kind of not have to put so many rows. So I'll try to do that. Can you hear my trebles now? <laughs> yeah, so I'm not going to be too choosy on the back. I'm going to go like quite down. And then my, I still have layers up to here. So then I can make a nice layer. It's a learning curve. Nice layer on my... Do, 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 do. Oh, I got some hair I need to add over here too. Let's do this. Jackson has a shirt that says, let's do this. And he says that often, so quite cute. And he's always like, let's do this, Grandma, when I say like an idea for a craft. <laughs> let's do this, Grandma. So cute. Starting to get sticky. Okay, see you later, Nikki. It's a very boring now. It's very boring. Okay, so now I'm just adding the, I'm going to put um, the tape roll and my wire roll here. So you guys can kind of maybe see a bit more. I got like four strands of fibers here and I'm going to catch the glue that's falling. So I'll add a few extra on the ends to make it. I'm hoping I'm not now, I'm not just not trying to go too fast, but. I put a lot of hair in on the first, in the front, so. I got, oh, it's all got to bunch up and, and get into a bun. Okay, there's three strands here. This could be the hardest hairdo I've done because uh, it could, kind of be a pain to try to keep track of how well it's tacking and I'm going a little faster in the back end here and I'm not sure if I'm liking that because I'm trying to get most of it done under an hour or in an hour stream Now I could just add some more glue, I think. I like this glue, so I know it's kind of a pain, but it does dry so nice. It looks just like nice fresh wool without any clumps of glue and tangling. It just looks so nice. It's not looking too bad. That, um... I don't even, like I've seen wool and glue before, I played with wool and glue before with the kids, you know, and you could just tell it's that there's glue in it. So. Kind of want that nice, almost like the wool's really growing out of the hair look or there's the scalp look and not have any glue left behind. This one's slipping. Where's my piece of tape? Here we go. Putting a little pressure on here. My... Okay. 
So I will have some hair strands going down as well here. I think I'm going to add some of those right now. So I'm going to rip this because I want to curl those. So that will kind of cover my um, neckline as well. Oh, this one's already made for me. So yeah, a little bit of a fuss with the hair. Oh, well worth it, I think. So even after it's all dry, I can add more of the glue and add more hair where I think it was too thin or something too. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. Cause I actually seriously cut, I think just enough hair. She is gonna be cute. Thank you, Denise. I think so. I know it's hard to see. I'm really sorry, guys. It's a white, white head. And, uh, A white, white head. <laughs> and I'm going to put a couple more strands. I'm going to put one more strand up. That's kind of shorter. Um, with my other one. I did end up um, adding just some glue after it was dry on top just to, and it just does not look like I added a bunch of glue to it. So that's what I love about it. Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit more glue here. Crazy. Oh okay. yeah. I'm liking it. I'm gonna put a little heat on it but not hot, like I said, number one, just to kind of gel the, might be a little too soon, but. This one moved. It's like putting little hair plugs in. I don't know, like, you know, I've seen Cora, she's really good. She puts, re puts, hair on with wool in Barbies and doll heads and stuff. Quite a lot of work, but she does it. Okay, here's another one. I've got a dog hair in there, black dog hair. <laughs> so I'm just gonna roll this. Got more glue on her ear. And this will be a process of me just kind of going over and rolling as she's drying. Okay. What a crazy do so far. <laughs> All you see is a clump of hair. <laughs> but it's coming along. It's a hard thing to record. I suppose if I record it from behind me, maybe a little bit better. Um, I might do that at some point when I, if I have to do one on a video. Dog hair, I'm pulling the hair out. Yeah, I definitely think I wanna add a few more pieces of hair in here after it dries. Definitely feels like it's working really nicely. So I think that now I got this front hair pinned up a bit. I'm not sure. I think I'm just gonna have to let it sit now, guys. Just like this. And uh, come back when it's dry, because now 
just showing you slightly. Some of it might come undone a bit. Um, so this is what the hair is kind of looking like. It's quite nice. I'm putting a lot of pressure on my back here by pulling it. Um, and there is room for improvement on the hair pieces here. Some of it's, whoa, some of it's just gonna fall apart right now because my tape. Anyway, some of it's gonna take a while to kind of let dry. So now I'm gonna let you guys go and come back, I guess, when this is dry. So thanks guys for joining me. And I'll be back at some time in the next couple of days or so. Thanks guys, and I'll let you go for now. Bye. Bye. <laughs> thanks for joining me, everyone.